Hey little angels, good morning to you. Hope you all are fine. Myself Preeti, your SS educator. Now kids, we already know that we are studying our very first chapter. We are revising it, our first chapter of SS, that's landforms of the world. Now your student, we saw what is landform. Okay, हमें पता चला कि landform क्या है. We know that it is not uniform all around the earth. right some places it's rising high while in some other places it's completely flat okay what are this these are the different features that makes up the earth's surface are called the landforms then we saw the four main types of landforms these are mountains plains plateaus and deserts we studied this much yeah then when we went towards our plateaus and valleys we also saw some valleys and passes okay in last lecture we studied about what is plain desert okay and also we saw the plateau so now is the time to study some other coasts okay some other features of land that is coasts peninsula bays and islands so students these are some other features that we see on our surroundings okay if we look around us if we go some to or we travel to other places we see somewhere there are water bodies as well hai na we see somewhere the sea shores somewhere we see an island what are all the students even these are the land features okay these all also you can say are a uh, landforms so in today's sessions we are going to study about this four features of the land that is the coasts peninsula bays and islands okay so let us first see what are coasts we will see the coast first so student a place where land meets the sea is called a coast so basically what they are saying is aisi jagah hai jahan pe sea land se meet up hoti hai use hum kehte hai coast okay for example or for an example student but it is a very common thing that we all have visited some or the other day a beach area hai na hum sab ne kahin na kahin pe beach pe gaye hain yes what we see over there that there is a land we are standing at a shore and we can see waves coming towards the earth okay towards us and at some point they are meeting up and they goes back hai na ab ye jo unka meeting point hota hai ye jo wo land surface pe jahan tak aati hai use hum kehte hai sea coast okay students so now these sea coast are of two types it can be a sandy also and it can be a rocky coast also so hum jo visit karte hain wo bahut tarah ka ka hota hai it can be sandy hum kabhi kabhi sands pe bhi gaye hain ya fir humne kabhi kabhi kai rocky jaise coast pe bhi jate hain okay so here is front of you the image of a sandy beach okay or a sandy coast you can say or this is the image of your rocky beach okay or a rocky coast you can say fine students so these is nothing but your coast your sea coast other the feature student is your peninsula now let us see what is peninsula now they say that a land mass which projects into the sea and is surrounded by water on three sides is called a peninsula अब वॉट आर दिस थिंग स्टूडेंट्स कि एक लैंड मास है ओके दैट इज अ लैंड मास विच ऑन थ्री साइड्स इज कवर्ड ओके इज मच और इज कवर्ड विथ वॉट विथ सी वॉटर ओके एंड देर वन ऑफ द टिप इज देर कनेक्टेड विथ द मेन आइलैंड दैट इज कॉल्ड योर पेनसुला नाउ स्टूडेंट योर this green color if you can see on this particular globe is nothing but your arabian peninsula okay ye image over here on the globe is the image of arabian peninsula now if you can see here ab dekho uske aaju baaju kaise khali jagah hai na white white we can see this is nothing but your water body your sea or the ocean ab hame isme kitna dikhai de raha hai acche se ki dekho uska kuch part of the land jo hai teeno side se kya hai wo covered hai Tino sides are surrounded here with what water, okay? And the main part is connected towards the land. 
so this type of places if we see somewhere this type of landmass if it is there then such are called peninsula and student this arabian peninsula is the largest peninsula in the whole world okay now i will show you our indian also now see this also if you see the southernmost part of our india okay so what we see over there also now we see that our southernmost part is surrounded with bay of bengal also indian ocean also and arabian sea also okay so what is happening all this three parts our our southernmost part of india is covered with is layered or you can say it is surrounded with all these three water bodies around it okay and the main part that is the topmost northern part is connected towards the mainland so such kind of landform students is called your peninsula here is the image of both showing your indian peninsula also and the arabian peninsula also but the that one is the biggest one okay now next is बल्जेरियन पेनसोला यार इज ऑल्सो अ स्मॉल लैंड फॉर्म स्टूडेंट वेर यू कैन सी देखो कि इट इज़ कनेक्टेड विद द मेन लैंड फॉर्म एंड तीनों साइड में क्या है वहाँ पे पानी से सराउंडेड है ठीक है ऐसी जगह हो जाती है हमारी पेनसोला यार इज अगेन द वेरी क्लोज फॉर्म वेरी क्लोज इमेज ऑफ द इंडियन southern most part where you can again properly see how the southern part of india is surrounded with water all three of its sides okay but this is nothing your peninsula now we will see what is bay now a bay is a water body running into land and surrounded on three sides by land bay of bengal along the eastern coast of india is an example for bay okay now what they are saying students kya keh rahe hai that bay is a water body ab hum ye land mass ki baat nahi karte ye baat kare about a water body jo teenon side se kya hai surrounded with land masses abhi tak humne peninsula mein kya dekha ki land mass hota hai jo teenon side se surrounded hai kis se वाटर बॉडी से नाउ दे आर इन बे दे आर सेंग दैट इट इज़ अ वाटर बॉडी विच इज़ सराउंडेड बाई लैंड ऑन थ्री ऑफ इट साइड इज कॉल्ड अ बे ओके नाउ यू आर इन द इमेज साइड गिवन स्टूडेंट इफ यू कैन सी इट इज़ एन इमेज ऑफ बे ऑफ बेंगाल ओके नाउ सी वो कैसे वाटर बॉडी है इट इज़ सराउंडेड विथ अवर लैंड फॉर्म्स है ना वहाँ पर वो सराउंडेड है हमारे कंप्लीट इंडियन लैंड फॉर्म से ठीक है and also with other countries it's covered with all three of its sides hai na to aisi water body ko hum kahenge bay i'll show you some more images now this is the hanauma bay okay which bay students it is the hanauma bay fine so this is your again another form of bay where you can see the chhota sa portion aa gaya hai water ka ठीक है देर इज़ अ स्मॉल पोर्शन ऑफ वाटर एंड जहाँ पे तीनों साइड इफ इट्स विजिबल टू यू इट इज़ द लैंड मास एंड वाटर बॉडी का जो अदर पोर्शन है इट इज़ कनेक्टेड टूवर्ड्स द ओशंस सच इज कॉल्ड योर बे ओके स्टूडेंट्स सो लेट अस मूव टूवर्ड्स नेक्स्ट नाउ वी विल सी आईलैंड अवर लास्ट वाटर बॉडी पार्ट दैट वी गोन टू स्टडी टू डे इज नथिंग बट योर आईलैंड नाउ वॉट इज आईलैंड स्टूडेंट an island is a land mass surrounded on all the sides by water now what are they saying that it is a land mass okay it is a piece of land which is surrounded by water on all the sides matlab sare charo ke charo side pe it is covered with water okay abhi peninsula mein kya tha wo three sides se connected tha it is surrounded was on three sides on with water okay but here an island is that it is surrounded on uh, all four of its sides with water okay so that type of land is called the island clear students now here what they have said that australian island is the biggest one okay it is the largest island in the world so ye jo aap image dekh rahe ho na this is nothing but your australian okay it is the australian landmass it is the australian one 
ऑस्ट्रेलियन आइलैंड विच इज़ द लार्जेस्ट इन द वर्ल्ड अब समझ में आपको वॉट इज़ आइलैंड इट इज़ अ पीस ऑफ लैंड जो चारों तरफ से क्या है सराउंडेड विथ वाटर ओके सो हियर अगेन आई हैव शोन यू द इमेज ऑन द ग्लोब ऑफ अवर ऑस्ट्रेलिया दैट हाउ इट इज जस्ट अ लोनली आइलैंड विच इज कन विच इज कवर्ड विच इज सराउंडेड विथ वॉटर ऑल फोर ऑफ इट्स साइड्स ओके अगेन स्टूडेंट देर इज वन मोर थिंग दैट इन अवर इंडियन मैप वी वुड हैव सीन द श्रीलंका ओके टू द एक्सट्रीम सर्दन मोस्ट पार्ट वी वुड हैव सीन वॉट दी श्रीलंकन कंट्री इज इंट इट सो वहाँ पर भी हम उसे भी क्या कहेंगे दैट इट इज़ अ फॉर्म ऑफ एन आईलैंड ओके फाइन स्टूडेंट्स सो यर टूडे वी कम्प्लीट अवर टूडे सेशन फाइन सो रेस्ट ऑफ इट विल बी कवर्ड इन अवर नेक्स्ट सेक्शन थैंक यू सो मच स्टूडेंट्स बी सेफ बी हेल्दी थैंक यू